Ocelot Penetrator is on sale for this week in GTA Online. It was released in the Import Export DLC, which came out a long time ago. So, looking into the car, definitely love the body style of the vehicle. It definitely has this catfish looking inspiration going on all around it. Now, this car was based off the Jaguar XJ220 in real life, of course. So, that's where Rockstar got the most, the, uh, the image from, and then they changed a couple of things. Leading out of the other five. Another thing is, I definitely love the engine model. And the interior is not that best, but it is fitting of the car, especially for its age. The import and export DLC was quite a long time ago, so I guess they did what they had to do with what they had. So let's take the car into the Los Angeles Customs and add some customizations. What brings you in today? So with this car's this age, it's definitely going to be a tall list of modifications on the car. But let's see what's available. For the bumpers, not that much. Definitely not liking the aftermarket modifications. So I'm definitely going to leave the bumper stock. Rear bumpers. And there's not that much. It's either carbon or some weird custom option. So I'm definitely going to leave that to stock. Engine model, engine level, level four. Now we could customize the air filters. Definitely loving the OEM look, so we might leave this stock also. Valve covers. Okay, I can't see from there. Let's try chrome. Definitely, definitely um, something different for me. I would do color match to the exterior, but let's do chrome for this one. Exhaust. The usual 750 should do you. Well, let's see what options they have. This is for me. That'll boost the door. Okay, this is 750. Now hood. What's changing on this one? Okay, so let's talk it as a vent. The ear ducts, they don't look the best. Leaving it stock also. My my fault, guys. Let's try it. Let's just switch out the lights. Plate, of course. No secondary color. Okay. Oh no. Uh, I do like a the red on this car, car, but I do want a different red. I don't want a basic red. Let's try something like. Let's see, this garnet sunset sunset looks pretty nice. Thirteen grand for a paint job, okay. Um, skirts the most generic part of the car. Let's see, no wing. Oh, oh wow! I don't like any of these wings. I would put this one on there, but. It's, You're gonna wanna watch if I'm not, I'm not gonna race this car anytime soon. So, because the car is in the super car, the supercar class, is, there's way too many cars that came out from the import and export DLC till now to even consider this thing. So this is definitely a cruiser. Windows, I'm not gonna do that because you can't see the engine model. Let's go back to non-tinted windows. Now, let's take a drive. So the modifications definitely work up on it. I'm definitely loving it. So I guess the car was four is four wheel drive, so it's kinda hard to keep the tail out, but you can do some decent power slots. But anyway, this car wasn't meant to go sideways anytime soon. Let's do the review on the road. Now, as you guys may have noticed, the car is for sale for this week. And I'm definitely liking the original price. So, so far, so good. I do recommend getting this thing so far. And the sound of it, even though the sound is recycled, it's all about the uh, characteristics of the vehicle, in my opinion. So, the sound, the looks, the handling, the acceleration, it's pretty good. Especially for something that came out quite a while ago. But the acceleration isn't the best. 
I would like to see Dukar get some type of boost in the future, like HSW or maybe with Benny's. You know, Rockstar can make that happen now. I guess with any card they choose. But it's definitely interesting to see how these cards, some cards are literally useless in races until they are HSW packaged, right? So let's see what's under the hood. What what can we open? Right? So take a look at the front. Oh, oh, this opens the opposite way. I did not realize that. And you can't even open the uh, inch way. So, it is what it is. I still like the car. Is it worth the original price? Yes. Is it worth the sale price? Of course, even cheaper. So, that's pretty much gonna be it for the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. Thank you guys so much.